Welcome everyone to the Passionate Pack Rat. Hope everyone's enjoying their day. What you see on display here is my mother's Hummel collection. Uh, these are Hummel porcelain figurines. They are hand painted, hand crafted, delicate little guys and girls. Uh, they are made by the Goebel Company in Germany in uh, Rodenthal, Germany. Uh, in 1935, Franz Goebel, uh, Goebel was a manufacturing company and they made all kinds of porcelain products. Uh, but in 35, uh, Franz Goebel bought the rights uh, to a bunch of drawings made by uh, Sister Maria Inocia Innocentia Hummel. Um, and she was an artist. She had these postcards of these children like this. So Franz Goebel bought the rights and started making these porcelain figurines. Like I say, they're handcrafted, uh, hand-painted. Um, and what's unique about these guys, uh, other than they're kind of cool, is the markings. They all they change their stamps quite a bit, uh, which in I think in fifty two or fifty nine they started using a bumblebee inside of a B uh, inside of a V, um, to and that believe it or not tells me this is through a magnifier. Um, when this was made you can see the little b inside there in, in the v and this would have been from uh 64 to 72. um they they changed their symbols quite a bit um not every year but pretty well every year um so let's see what this guy yeah this one's i think a little different than the last one um again uh, the B. So that tells me with that, that was probably made again in 64 to 72. They stopped using the B and then they brought it back in the 2000s. Goebel, uh, I believe, sold the rights to uh, another company. Um, but yeah, they're kind of cool. Uh, again, they had some have Goebel underneath it. Um, with a copyright, with the C copyright. The bigger ones are, are of course, worth more. Um, although, you know, at one time, uh, these fetched a, a fair price, but now uh, the smaller ones, they're anywhere from 35 to $70, I would say. The bigger ones, maybe 100 uh, this just has Goebel West Germany, which was a later edition, uh, probably 72 to 79, I think. <clears throat> they quit using the, uh, no, they still had the B stamp, so this might have been 79 to 1990, actually. So there you go, I'm not sure what that guy is. Uh, but again, more detailed, the bigger, the bigger ones. Uh, again, this is a little different. I don't know how well you can see that bumblebee in there. Um, yeah, not too well. <laughs> Anyways, I'm going to be uh, giving away some of these guys. I, I've given them away to my brothers and anyone who's wanted them in the family has taken them. Um, <clears throat> so if anyone's interested... Uh, please let me know. Um, they'd make a nice gift. Um, I'm going to be running contests uh, every week in October and November, uh, probably for eight weeks. Uh, so I'm just formulating all the plans and details. I'm going to be giving all kinds of, like this, Royal Dalton's uh, cards, of course. I, I've got other things that I'm going to give away that I haven't exposed yet. So... Um, stay tuned for that. Anyways, that's my collection. Uh, thanks for watching and uh, 
let me know what you think of these guys. Uh, I've grown up with them, so I kind of like them, <laughs> you know, but I don't want them all too thick. And, you know, I have some favorites, like the Umbrella Kid. I like that. It's, he's cute. Anyways, yeah, little lamb. Isn't that cute? I shouldn't hold it by his head, but I am. Anyways, thanks for watching. Have a great day. Take care of yourselves. Please take care of those around you. Most importantly, bye for now.